So what's the thing you haven't forgiven yourself for? I mean, what's the thing that happened eight or nine years ago that you've been holding against yourself? You can't let yourself forget that it happened. What if today you chose to let it go and you forgave yourself? My name is Rodney McKenzie and you're watching More Life Video Blog and I'm talking to you today about that exact same thing, about choosing right here, right now in this moment to forgive yourself. You know, there's sometimes in our lives that we do something and we just can't believe it. I mean, something happens and we can't believe we did that to someone. We can't believe we did that to ourselves. I mean, sometimes we look in the mirror and we're shocked at the person that we see because we never thought that we would hurt someone the way we hurt them. We never thought we could violate ourselves the way that we violated ourselves. I mean, we can't believe what we did. Forgive it. I mean, let it go. You know, I know that you did something 15, 20 years ago that you can't believe, but forgive it. I mean, let it go. I mean, I know you can't believe that you did the very thing that you said that you would never do, but forgive it. I mean, forgive it and let it go. You know, Paul Farini says that we're the judge, we're the prosecutor, and we're the juror. And today, what we get to decide is that we're innocent, that we're free, and we forgive ourselves. We forgive ourselves for everything that we believe that we've done. We forgive ourselves for every idea that we weren't worthy. We forgive ourselves for believing that we did anything wrong because, in truth, we didn't. I mean, everything that's happened in our lives was a curriculum. I mean, everything that happened in our lives was purposeful. Everything was helping us be here right now in this moment. I mean, forgive yourself. You know, I know you can't believe it happened, but it happened. Forgive yourself. You know, I know you can't believe you did that, but I'm sorry, but just forgive yourself. You did nothing wrong. You're innocent. Just forgive it and let it go. See, we have an opportunity to, to, opportunity to be like our father, to be like our mother, to be like the divine itself who doesn't see that, who only sees us as we are, perfect, whole, and complete. Today, we have an opportunity to remember that we're loved, to remember that we are power and peace and presence and self, and because of that, we forgive those moments of craziness, those moments where we lost our minds for a second, those moments where we were hoping that someone else could love us, those moments where we felt like we had to prove something, forgive it. You were innocent the whole time. You did nothing wrong. Let it go. You know, today I'm choosing to remember who I am. Today I'm choosing to let go of what happened 30, 40 years ago and live right here in the now and forgive it all. I mean, I forgive myself for believing I could do anything wrong. I forgive myself for believing that I needed to prove something to someone else. I forgive myself for all the times that I violated someone else because I was in truth violating me. Today, I forgive it all. Will you join me today in forgiving yourself? I mean, will you join me today, regardless of what it looked like, just forgiving yourself and knowing that you can be set free by your own word? And so it is, all right? Peace.